we are friends, we are here today to commemorate the uprising of the Greek students and of the Greek people against the dictatorship NATO, dictatorship by Trumpa. And one of the big lessons of uh, this uprising is that popular movements can impact on society. And this is what we see today as well. We have a situation in Palestine where we have a wonderful resistance of the Palestinian people. And Israel is committing genocide, genocide in an unprecedented way, but people are resisting and they will not pass through. This is the most important thing. They, whatever they do, how big the crimes are they commit, resistance will not only continue, resistance after that will even be strong. And the regimes in favor of intervention in the region will be weakened. And if they continue this way, these regimes will fall as well. And the popular uprising in the Middle East will come out. But this is not the only place where intervention is being confronted. It's in Ukraine, it's in uh, the east of Europe, where a powerful resistance against NATO extension to the East, against NATO is being waged. And also there, intervention is not really, it's about to move. And this is a very good sign. But the power, they are trying to, uh, to defend their supremacy, to uh, wage war against the world is going on. And so the big fear is that also in the Far East, the war tensions are rising and imperialism will uh, launch war against China, against Korea, and so on. And all this we need not to stabilize in the American Empire, it will again lead to defeat of American imperialism. And what is our task is to go in this movement, to strengthen the popular forces, and to transform this resistance against the American Empire into popular and socialist revolutions. And this is why we come together and organize ourselves in this election. Thank you.